morning and welcome to Bumblebee Junction. Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Today is a cool and overcast day but it's absolutely perfect for being outside getting a little work done. The rain has stopped and the warmer temperatures and the rain means the grass is growing and not a hundred percent sure I want to bring out the mowers just yet because we are expecting a cold snap um, later on in the week. So there is still a lot of work to be done and a lot of trimming and the chickens know exactly what that means and um, yeah, it's snack time. So, I'm going to go out here. I'm going to get started. Um, today will probably be a bit more of a vloggy kind of day. I do have some more garden beds and trellises that need cleaned up. And like I said, I got to get the weed whacker out. So, yeah, we got a lot to do. Let's get to it. Okay, I'm over here cleaning up around Turtle Pond, did the trimming, but this is my dappled willow, and those are fresh green leaves, and she is just covered, yeah. So we have our first greenage, and when I looked up, now back here you can see we're behind the coops, and there are still Plenty of crocuses out here blooming, which is the other reason I don't really want to mow just yet. But, these three big willow trees, they have leaves too. Yep, they are already starting to get woke up. And it looks like all three of them are. One, two, three. They sure are. And... Oh, I just saw something else too. This is the maple tree, and she's got leaf bugs too. Yep, probably see a little bit better up there at the top. But like I said, we are back here by the creek and chicken coops. Yeah, the maple tree's waking up too. That is so exciting. Spring is definitely here. Oh, and hold on, I got one more really neat spring thing to show you. Hold on. I'm sure you can hear the creek babbling on in the background, but these are my hyacinths coming up here on the creek bank, and I just knocked my glasses off. 
There are daffodils and hyacinths blooming the entire length. Some of them are just barely starting to open up. Just barely. But we have some bloom down here. Got another pretty pink. Yes, daffodils. Yeah, how pretty is that? But I gotta get back to work. But don't forget, you have to stop and smell the flowers once in a while. Okay, took a little break, had to go in and visit Mark in the shop, but it is now time to get back to work and I'm going to start doing the trimming around the entire uh, garden over here. So hold on, and I'll be right back. Okay, I have run all six batteries out of my weed whacker, but I still have two of these trellises that I've got to get up into and get all of the stuff out of the top of them, which require a ladder, which is probably why I haven't done it quite yet. So I'm going to get up here on this ladder. I'm going to get this trellis cleaned up. There's one at the other end of the garden. And I actually, I have two or three beds that still need the winter weeds out. So I'm going to get back to work. Okay, I got both of the trellises cleaned off, but I wanted to show you this. I was just sitting and taking a break and found a little four-leaf clover. Yeah. But I'm going to sit and finish my break, and then I've got a few bags I've got to get to. And then, actually, I have made quite a mess cleaning everything up. I'm going to have to get all that cleaned up, too. But hold on. I'll be right back. Okay. Every bag's clean. The trellises are all clean. 
And I should bring it down here and show you the garlic. They are getting really big. But I have made a nice mess of throwing all this stuff out. So I've got to get that cleaned up. But all of these beds are clean. Now I know I'll have to do it again because even though you can't hardly grow a vegetable right now, um, the weeds will grow. So probably have a few more winter weeds to have to deal with, but everything is all clean and ready. Peas have not come up yet, but they're not going to be far off. In fact, I still have to water them for the day. And we'll come over here and check on the broccoli and the cabbage really quick. They are good and happy and uh, I'm going to go ahead and water them before I head in. I'm going to get this mess cleaned up. I'm going to get these guys watered up and then I'm going to call it a day. Alright, so that's all that I have for today. I am absolutely wore out and I still have still have to water here real quick so I'm gonna go ahead and get on out of here but um if you're not subscribed to the channel please subscribe don't forget to ring that little bell to let you know when we're out here digging something else up um if you have any comments questions suggestions anything else at all on your mind please leave them in the little box below and if you enjoyed today's video please give it a thumbs up now that is a whole lot of work that I'm really glad is done. It was actually a very nice cool day to do it. And we have a lot of stuff that we can still be working on getting into the ground. I'm not going to spoil any any upcoming videos or anything, but we do have um, a shipment that we're waiting on and a few other things that we'd like to get in the ground. So. I'm going to go ahead and get on out of here. It is about time to start thinking about dinner, and I am tired. So don't forget, we love you, and we'll see you in the next one.